no need to be nervous. You're gonna smash it. Don't talk about smashing things. What if Jordan had fallen through those floorboards? Well, she didn't. And you won't be making that mistake again. No, I'll just make worse ones. Why did I think I could do this? But you know you can. All you need to do is look after Jordan like you've looked after Jess. They're ready for you, Tracy. Who's coming in with you? My mum. Sorry, me darling. We're closed. Viv! Is everything OK? I was in the area. I could have phoned, but I thought I'd pop in to tell you that your application has been approved. What did you say? Approved, my love. Congratulations. The fostering's going ahead. <sighs> it was like she'd been holding everything in, and now she could finally let it out. Oh, I really thought I'd mess that up with the floorboards and the ceiling. <laughs> we all could. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey. Thought you might need a bit of support. Jordan's files make tough reading, huh? How can anyone treat a child like that? <sighs> Damaged people hurt others. It's a cycle. Well, this is where it stops. Yeah. Cam, I was thinking, what about my own files? Oh, you can send for them. I know, I'd never wanted to before, but when the panel were asking me if I'd made peace with my own past and... You said you had. I say a lot of things. <laughs> I'd noticed. Look, do what you need to do. I'm here, always. Love you. I love you too. Look, I promise. Everything's going to be OK. Jess, is that you? Yeah. Oh. What have you got in your face, you silly girl? Uh, her face, her choice. Um, yeah, we're not in school now, are we? We're not in the circus, either. <laughs> <laughs> circus. I'm sorry, what did you say? If you've got something to say, you can say it to me. Um, stop it. I don't need you to fight like that. Is that your files, then? Yep. Well, what's the point of living in the past? Hey, Jess. How's Tyrone? Fine. I love you, Mum. Oh, love you, too. So how's everything with Paige now? Um, yeah, we're fine, me and Paige. Um, that wasn't really the problem. Well, what was the problem? I could just tell Mum what Asha did. She'd tell Dad, Asha would be punished. Maybe they'd even go home. Did I want that? Nothing. Um, I was just going through some stuff. OK. Let's make a deal. I promise to stop pestering you if you promise me that everything's OK. I promise that everything is OK. Good. Right, he wants hot chocolate. Me! me. Yes, go, shoot! Yes, Tyrone! Come on! That's it, Tyrone! Go, go, go! Oh, go on! I think he's gonna score. Mum? I'm really glad you're OK. Top of the world. No views like this where we live, is there? Just tower blocks and concrete. I came to tell you, Sean's got me a place in the academy. Yeah? Wow, that's really... Wow. I need you OK. I have it, right? Um, I guess, but... So you, you'll have to stay there, right? 
Drunk time time, yeah. So it works out for both of us. I get my dream and you'll finally be sure of me. Tyrone, you don't really think... Maybe you fooled the others, but it's just us. You could drop the act. <sighs> Come on, the only reason why you came today is because you thought I had a chance. One day I'll go pro and be minted. That is really not what... Relax. I'll buy you a house, nice things, whatever you want. All I want is for you to be happy. Stop it! Stop saying that! I know I've made mistakes. I've made bad choices. If I could take them back, I would. It's just words, Mum. Look how hard you've worked all these months for your dream. I'm just so proud of you. You've inspired me. If you let me, I will work every day to put you first. Honestly, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if I could trust you. If you want to go to the Academy, I will back you 100%. I will miss you every day. So, where are you headed? Home. Power blocks and concrete. Is that OK? Definitely. Absolutely. If I've learned anything from football, it's that the best things take work. Yeah. I want to work. But us, I mean. I want to work my socks off, Tyrone. Me too. Come over here. I want to talk to you. About what? Well, does a mother need a reason to speak to her daughter? There's just so much going on at your age. You know, friends, school, boys. Oh, Mum. I told Mum everything. Love was even worse than Flo had said. It didn't just make me tongue-tied and sweaty. It made me lie to all my friends. And now I had to do a stand-up show in front of them all. But that's tonight. I know. Blimey, me, Jess. That is a right beacon mess. Look, I don't know what to do, because well, I can't exactly tell a page about Mosey, but the idea of getting on stage in front of everyone, um, well, it, it makes me want to be sick. I'm just going to look so stupid. Yeah, probably. Mum. Well, what do you want me to say? You've never done stand-up comedy before. But you're doing this for your mates. That's a pretty big way of saying you're sorry. I've been thinking a lot about love recently. And through my many, many, many years of experience, <laughs> I have realised something. Love's a nightmare! <laughs> we try and impress people, we act weirdly around people who think like us. Standing up on an open stage was a drastic answer to the mess I'd made. The only thing I've got left to do is to say, I love all of you. Jordan says she's fine. She's still talking to Asha. Still? Well, let's hope she's getting to the bottom of this. Wish I was. Can't believe Asha's a shoplifter. She is, though. I saw her. This is a nightmare. I'm gonna have to ban them from seeing each other, aren't I? Why would you do that? To keep Jordan out of trouble. <laughs> Who's JC? Oh, it's AJ. He wants to show us his art. Strictly non-VIPs only. Mm hmm. Sounds fun. Shall we go? Hang on. I mean, what about Jordan and Asher? That's why I brought you both here. Do you trust Jordan? Yeah. Then don't rush into anything. Just wait and hear what she has to say. I mean, she knows Asher best. It might just be those two are good for each other. How can Asher be good for Jordan? She just causes trouble. What do you mean? Is there something else I should know about? No. Um, nothing you should know about. Well, never shoplift. It's a really stupid thing to do. Although teenage girls do stupid things. I should know. Yeah, and they can also be surprisingly smart. I should know. <laughs> I just get this feeling like a weight crushing me here. And I have to do something crazy to throw it off. Do I give you that feeling? Sometimes. Like with the piano lessons. I'm sorry. I was trying to help. I know. 
can just be a lot sometimes. OK. Next time you feel that, please tell me and I'll try to stop. Will you promise? Promise. And remember, whatever you do, I'm proud of you. I know you're proud. You always say it. And that's a bad thing? I just want to make you happy. You do? No, I don't. Sai does. Ajay does. Dad did. All I can ever do is just not make you more sad. <laughs> You're wrong. This makes me happy. What? You trust me enough to be honest with me. So I must have done something right. Of course you have, Mum. You're... 